Hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a very exciting video here today. Uh, yesterday, or the day before, actually, I wrapped up the Review Starlight movie. Uh, it was fantastic, by the way. You guys should watch Review Starlight. It's really good. But that's not why we're here today, to heap praise on that movie. We're going to pick 10 more things that I'm going to put on a poll, and we're going to vote on them, and I'm going to watch them on the channel. How incredible is that? That is kind of the process in which I do this. Cool. So as always, I've just kind of pulled a bunch of stuff from the Discord on what I should watch and what sounds cool and that kind of thing. There was a couple that I skipped over for pretty obvious reasons. So first we have a ton of movies. So I'm probably going to do the movies in some other format at a different time, maybe an in-between thing, cool-off thing. So I've got a ton of Satoshi Kon stuff in this corner of the world, as well as Yuasa's Inu Or. So those are all being considered, they're just movies, so you know how it is. I should mention that I'm taking these from the requests for the channel poll. If it was in any other channel on Discord in the past, it's been lost to time. It needs to go in this channel if it wants to be on a poll. Machikado Mazoku, or The Demon Girl Next Door. I've already seen half of this, actually pretty recently, so I don't think it'll make for a very good video in that regard, as well as Knights of Sidonia. Me and my friend have actually been making our way through this one as well from time to time. So again, already seen a little bit of it, can't put it on the poll because it's not blind. Because if I put a bunch of stuff that I wasn't blind to on the poll, then I'll put a bunch of my favorite shows and I'll just gush over them for a while, which I'm pretty sure nobody wants to watch. Or maybe they do. It would make me happy, but no, don't do that. It's, it's, it's poor content. What's good content is the 10 I've chosen, supposedly. Well, again, a few of them have been chosen by Discord. Anyway, I'm rambling. I should just get into them. So, so big one up first, Revolutionary Girl Utena, which is an absolute classic. Um, I know that much at least, and it's the longest thing here. So that's another thing I've done is I've kind of increased a little bit on my, my length of show. Um, I'm still not doing anything with like a lot, a lot of seasons and movies and stuff, so that's why Girls und Panzer isn't here either. It'll go probably be on a Simpho Gear replacement poll, something like that. But yeah, there's a couple of shows here that are a little bit on the longer side. But yeah, I'm, I'm making an exception. And <laughs> since I'm doing nothing but saying qualifiers, uh, this is also why Penguin Drum isn't here, because too much Ikuhara all at once is bad for the brain. But also, um, they'll cannibalize each other's poll results, you would think, so why not just put one up? Next on the list, I have Sora no Woto, Sound of the Sky, which is 12 episodes plus some specials potentially. I know nothing about this one, I've seen the poster, it looks cute, and uh, it seems to be slice of lifey, so sounds up my alley. Sound of the Sky with like Sky Girls or something, sure. This is another big one, up next, Oshi no Ko. I've already seen the first episode to this one. My understanding is that there may be 11 more episodes or 10 more episodes potentially because that first one was so long. But as I've said, I've watched that first episode already, was a huge fan, haven't seen anything else for it. I'd imagine it continues the story pretty much how it sets up from the end of the that, that last episode. Seems to be pretty well considered, seems to be the pick of the show's last season. So we'll jump into that if it wins. The next one here is Princess Tutu which seems to be some pretty classic Magical Girls stuff. Potentially a little bit of a meta aspect to it as well, which is cool. We like that. Um, 38 episodes, but some of them are half length is the way I understand it. So kind of fits within that boundary. Yeah, I know not much about this as well. So that would be completely and totally blind. I know nothing. Another one which I know completely nothing about is Sabote ga F Ninaru which is the perfect insider. It's been sold to me as kind of a similar to Kubikiri cycle type job in that its source material is also won the Mephisto prize, which I looked up before. It's kind of a literary prize for mystery novels in Japan. So if you've got a mystery on the caliber of Kubikiri cycle in the Zaragoto series, then potentially that's up my alley as well. 11 episodes on that one. So those previous five entries were the ones that I pulled from Discord. Now I've got two next shows, which are by tradition, the kind of runners up from the last poll, which I'd like to bring forward again. So in the last poll, it was weird, kind of, it was Kubikuri Cycle at number one, one vote below. 
uh, was Review Starlight. So I've watched those two shows in a row, like I said I would. And then the next two shows below that were on a tie. And those two shows were Mobile Suit Gundam, The Witch from Mercury, which has 24 episodes plus some other stuff, maybe because it's weird with Gundam, so I don't, I don't know, um, which I'm pretty keen to see. As well as, randomly enough, Kokoro Connect, which I had no idea would do as well as it did, but the demand is there, so it's coming back. Kokoro Connect, 13 episodes on that one as well. Now, kind of like last time, I went to Mal, and I just looked up, like, best shows, do do top anime, and scrolled down for a bit and picked some stuff that tickled my fancy that I'd always wanted to maybe have a look at. There was a few things that were a little bit too long, and that's where <laughs> that's where that replacement poll for whatever comes first, Monogatari or, or Symphogi will come into it. But, uh, but Mononoke, that is something I have chosen. So not Princess Mononoke, just Mononoke. I don't know if this show is well known, but I know about it. It's got a crazy art style. It should be scary, which will be interesting in my kind of format. I, I get scared pretty easily, so... I don't know, we'll, we'll see. And again, that's 12 episodes, plus potentially a little bit of a prequel something. It was weird. Um, next one, Golden Time, because I wanted a rom-com, damn it. and Because I, I like rom-coms. Uh, the other choice would have been uh, that one that recently aired, but I've read all the source materials for them. That would have been, you, you know, your, your after-school insomniacs or whatever the hell, the skip and loafer or whatever the hell, and the... The dangers of my heart, whatever the you know, all those they they seem to be well regarded from the last season. But I've I've read all the source material because I'm a fiend. So golden time, we're going back in time a little bit. Twenty four episodes on that one, and then another one that I've always wanted to watch is Shirobako, which I'm putting in the last slot, the tenth slot here. Uh, Twenty four episodes and potentially a movie for that one about the production of anime in a little bit more of a job feel sense. I don't know. Bit left field, but I've always wanted to see it. And yeah, that's our 10. So if you're not privy to the polling process, then you should become privy to it by me telling you that you should go to Discord. There'll be a link in the description. You go to the polls section on Discord and you vote for your favorite. You should get three votes, so spread them however you want. You can't vote. Yeah, you get three options that you can pick. You can't put them all on one, if that makes any sense. I did say in the past that I would do a little bit more of a process for my polling, but I'm a bit lazy today, so we're just going to go <laughs> with the with the tried and true method, which does have some inherent bias, disadvantages, and that kind of thing. But, yeah, then's the breaks. I think most of the time the best thing, or the most supported thing, wins. So, yeah. So, yeah, go vote on that poll. Um, I pretty keen to see all 10 of these shows so i don't really have a horse in the race um so go for your life vote on what you want and yeah that's about it i'm gonna sign off that thanks for watching and yeah vote please